How to remove background from image online free with just a few clicks to speed up your workflow and get more done. If you want to learn how to remove the background from a photo automatically using only free apps online, then you've come to the right video. Hey, it's Poyek. Today, I'm going to show you two websites that will completely remove the background of an image with just a few clicks and save you heap of time from manually picking pixels. Both of these apps have their pros and cons. I'll walk you through their features and demonstrate these apps with various types of photos such as portrait shots, action shots, physical items, and more to help you decide. You can find all the links I'll be mentioning in this video at the description box down below. And if you're new to this channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button to stay up to date with the best tools and strategies to grow your influence and productivity. So let's jump right into it. The first background removal app is called remove.bg. Once you're here, all you need to do is upload an image. So let's go over to my folder and try an image of a person to demonstrate this to you. And as you can see, with just a few clicks, the background of this photo was completely removed. This was the original photo and this was the background removed photo. And when you download it, the PNG will be saved to your computer with the transparent background. Now, let's try something with sports to see how well this app does with action shots with two people in it. And as you can see, it has done a nice job removing the background of this more sophisticated photo too. Now, let's try a physical item. Maybe you're doing e-commerce or selling something physical for your store. And by the way, if you would like to download this stock photo bundle that comes with 3,000 royal free stock photos that you can use for all your projects, if you watch till the end, I'll show you where to download this as well. Okay, now let's try this pestle and mortar spices. And wow, as you can see, it retained the details of the spices very well. And what I like about remove.bg app is that you're given the opportunity to edit the image to further refine the background removal if needed. Say, for example, if the background removal wasn't cleaned up properly or there are certain parts of your photos that you would like to remove, under the Erase and Restore tab, you can do just that. So let's say in this image, maybe you only wanted to have the pestle and mortar for your image and you didn't want to include the spices. So over here under Erase and Restore, you just need to run over and click on the areas that you want to erase. You can also restore it, um, the sections that you wanted to include in your photos. But for this demo, let's undo the steps by clicking the undo reverse icon over here. And under the backgrounds tab, you can also replace it with another background if you want to select it from your own folders or you can use these presets that they have provided for you as well you can also replace it with a solid color but for this demonstration let's just stick with the transparent background now to the not so good and limitations of this app under the downloads you'll notice here are two download options Preview Image and HD Image. The free version of this app is limited to downloading the preview resolution only, which is the exact size you see on screen. If you need to work your images on higher HD resolutions, the caveat of this app is that HD image downloads are chargeable per credit, which you can check out at the pricing tabs above. Otherwise, if the preview resolution is good enough for your project requirements, you can use this app to remove backgrounds from your photos unlimited times for free. And this image app also works on smartphones. If you go to remove.bg through your smartphone's browser, you'll be able to download from your phone's gallery and remove the background of your image on the fly as well. But 
What if you would like to work with a high definition photo and do not wish to compromise on your image resolution? This is where the second online app I'm going to introduce to you comes in. It's also my preferred app and it's called Adobe Photoshop Express. The Adobe Photoshop Express online app is a little tricky to find in the search engines and the URL is quite long. So head down to the links below in the description box to access it. Once you're here, click on remove background and it'll take you to the app. Then over here, upload the image that you would like to remove. Let's try another one with a person. You'll then be prompted to sign in to use this feature. But if you don't have an account yet, you can create one from over here, which is completely free. I already have an account with Adobe, so I'll go ahead and sign in. Okay, once we're signed in, as you can see, Photoshop Express is doing its magic to remove the background and processing the photo. And just like that, you can see the background has also been removed with just a few clicks. And if you were to zoom in, the original image resolution is retained and that's what I love about it. And over here, you can also change the background with solid colors. But let's just keep it transparent and hit apply. Besides the high resolution that Photoshop Express retains, what you also find useful is the additional editing features. Right now, we're in the Remove Background option, but over here on the left, you can see you can also resize the image and you can also crop and straighten the photos. So for example, over here, we can see there are some spacing at the top of her head. We can actually bring this down and also bring the sides closer to her. And you can also rotate it if you wish or flip the image. And there's also the aspect ratio that you can use if you want to crop the image to specific aspect dimensions according to the different social platforms. But for this example, let's just go ahead and crop the image like this. And under touch up, you can also fix blemishes. For example, for this model, if you were to zoom in, you will see there's this white marking on her forehead. So to do the touch up, all you need to do is to select the brush size that you want. Okay, and just run over to area that you would like to fix. And this app will blend the area around it to make it look seamless. But I think she looks gorgeous as she is. So let's undo the steps for that. Then under adjust image, you can also play around with the color grading presets provided over here. Or you can customize your own lighting and coloring preference under details. So as you can see, this app is packed with a lot of features that you can use to touch up your photos and do the color gradings if needed. And under art effects, you can stylize your image with different art effects such as oil paint, cartoon effects, pop art, and etc. But let's just leave it as it is for now. And to download the image, simply hit the download button at the top right hand over here. And it will prompt you to select the file format for JPEG or PNG. So what we want to always bear in mind is that JPEG does not have transparency. If you want your background to have transparency, you need to be selecting PNG. Let's just hit the download for this. And over here, you can see once you open up the photo, you have the transparent background for this image and the background was removed. However, with comparison to the earlier app, Photoshop Express doesn't allow you to further refine the background removal with the restore and erase option like what remove.bg has. But overall, I personally like the Photoshop Express better because it retains the image resolution and it does a relatively good job with the background removal without the need to further refine it. Another limitation is if you try to access Adobe Photoshop Express online via your smartphone, you will see that it says this web app is only available on desktop. A simple get around to this is to switch your phone browser to desktop mode by tapping the three dots at the top right hand corner to pull out the menu and select desktop site. 
you'll then be able to use Photoshop Express to remove backgrounds like in the desktop version. And one power tip for both of these apps to remove image background flawlessly is to shoot your photos with color contrast between the subject and the background. For example, if you have dark hair and dark colored clothing, don't capture your photo with a dark colored background because this will raise a problem for the app to detect the separation between the subject and the background. If you have dark hair, capture your photo with a light colored background. So you can see from over here, the app will remove and clean up the background quite flawlessly, even to the details of the hair. And as promised, let's get to the 3000 professional stock photos giveaway. To download this huge library of royalty-free stock photos, click the link at the description box below this video and let me know where to send it. And if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up by hitting the like, subscribe and bell button. And comment below to let me know what you learned and what kind of tutorials or tips you want to see more of to help you grow your influence and productivity. I'm Po Yik and I'll see you soon. Thank you.